less time than I thought. All right, cool. It is, and the moment you came back, the first half ended. Nice. All right, now I assume I put Mr. Domino in this PS1 binder. Front mission, Musashi, Einhander, Save the Other Night, Ray Crisis. That's, this is probably where, oh, I don't know what the hell goes there. Machida Blade, Soul Blade, Strider, Apocalypse. God, why have I not said I'm going to play Apocalypse? Why don't I play the Bruce Willis game? <laughs> Halftime stat, score 31 to 6. Passing yards, Oakland 198 to the Jets. Like, I think it's a 98. I mean... Go to a halftime stats real quick and update the chat and see what we're gonna do with this. Uh, recap? Is that what I want? Yes. Uh, apparently, passing it's 198 to 93. Apparently, there's okay. also a game called No One Can Stop the Farm Pioneer. <laughs> I learned a lot tonight about video games. Troll 30,000. Yep, 30,000. Thank you for subscribing. Here is your egg. Disappointed! Sorry, apparently I have the troll back because that was the wrong sound file. You will give me an egg! Thank you for subscribing. He says, please, I want my egg. <laughs> So, quick halftime comparison stats. Matt Flynn, 13 for 18 for 199 yards. No touchdowns and an interception compared to Mark Sanchez, who's 9 for 17 for 96 yards. And no touchdowns, no interceptions. But the amazing thing here is Darren McFadden, 124 yards and four touchdowns. Jeez. So, I'll leave this up to you guys. Do you want to end this at halftime at 31-6 and go on to NHL 14, or do you want to see how bad this gets? And that's up to you, too. What, do you want NHL, or do you want to see how terrible this gets? Personally, I want to see how terrible it gets. NHL, NHL, how bad. NHL. I think a lot of people say keep it going to see how bad it gets. Alright, keep it going. And then meanwhile, we'll focus on no one can stop Mr. Domino. Okay, our options are fast! Which is up, apparently. Down for slow. Left for left, right for right. Drop, 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 drop is for every other button. God, it's been a while since I played this. I don't know if I can remember how this works. I wonder if I actually have a save on here. Okay, never mind. That would have been on the PS3 I played this then. So my choices are Mr. Domino or Miss Domino. I think we have the... I don't know. These are both pretty amazing choices here. One see, one's smiling, but the other one's happy. Uh, lots of misses. All right, fair enough. Uh, her numbers are going to be eight and nine. Slow. Do the numbers mean anything? No. I believe they're just customization. I'm at Fat mm. Tony's Casino. Now, I'm supposed to basically just keep dropping dominoes and cover up five different uh, numbered spots on the board. Doing so, uh, God, doing so knocks them off. And once I get all five, I've beaten the stage. Oh, I've already screwed up pretty bad here. Okay.
Also, Mr. Domino's a fucking asshole. Okay, I'm out of dominoes, so now I've just gotta run into them and set them off. But if I gotta do this while there's a time limit, I can't remember what actually dictates the time limit. Okay, so let's run into the first domino. And that failed miserably, so let's hit the second one. Okay, we've hit the first switch. Now let's run into the second set. Which hit nothing. And the third set. Hits a switch. Hits another switch. Oh shit, I didn't mean reset. Oh no, I might have made a huge mistake. Oh no, I've made a terrible mistake. Oh god damn it. All those buttons I hit are now reset. I've made a huge mistake. Not again! Ah! And uh, game over, I believe. Yep. Failed. Dan, stop it. <laughs> I know you're capping, but stop it. I think I've oh. seen. I think I remember you playing this game, because I think you'd be the only one I know who owns this game. Uh, yeah, I could see that being the case. Uh, actually, there are a surprising amount of people calling for impeaches. Wow, okay. Alright, well, if you want impeach, let me at least beat the stage, and then we'll go with the impeach, okay? It's hitting the health, I believe, that extends the timer. I'm not 100% sure on that, but that seems right. Oh, I'm out of dominoes again, so I better just hurry up. I just don't remember what it specifically shows that you're dying. It definitely seems like a really unique game. Like it, it is, but I can see why people wouldn't like it, and it's also like super weird for a stream, especially with that stupid reset button. That's what pisses me off, that they would actually have that in the game. Oh shit, I missed the last... No! Why would they do that? Why would you put that in a game? That is such bullshit. All right, if I fail this time, then yeah, maybe we'll just impeach this because that's that's kind of fucking stupid. It's really weird. There's two of them, or yeah, or is that the same one? That's two. There's two of them. Fuck. Okay, I gotta hurry. I gotta hurry up and get to a healing item. Got it. Crap, crap, crap. No, not again! I thought that's where the healing item was. Shit. No one can stop Mr. Domino, but can Mr. Domino stop himself? <laughs> Mr. Domino may or may not have a problem. <laughs> Alright, this time I'm not actually going to hit the stupid reset. Let's get around the board again. 
That is kind of bullshit. I don't care what anyone says. Although I guess that's technically where the challenge comes from. Otherwise. So what is the point of the level? They hit all the switches? Yeah, you gotta hit all the, the glowing switches. And hitting oh. the switches will will make something happen to where the glowing spot is. So that glowing spot starts a combo if you put dominoes there. Which is why like, I just got like a, a crazy 4 chain. Also, now I'm getting warned that my health's low again. I don't think I'm near a healing item. My god, am I gonna fail anyways? Ah, fuck, I'm totally gonna fail anyways. I'm totally gonna fail anyways. Holy shit. Oh my god. Alright. Fuck it. No one can stop Mr. Domino, but I'm certainly starting... Blah, fuck. <laughs> no one can stop Mr. Domino, but I'm certainly stopping the game right now, because that's kind of bullshit. Impeached. And already goodbye. It's a unique <laughs> game, but, um, yeah. Kind of bullshit at times, too. And Darren McFadden gets injured in the game. All right. Let's get our cookie back on going here now. Our five choices for this round of the fortune cookie are as follows. Spider-Man 1 for the PlayStation 1. Bomberman Act Zero Multiplayer for the Xbox 360. Followed by these three games. 99 Nights for the Xbox 360. Singularity for the Xbox 360. And finally, Mobile Light Force, better known as, I think, uh, Gunbird 1 for the PlayStation 1. Come on, Spider-Man. That's probably the... I think that's the best Spider-Man game. Spider-Man 1? Pretty good. Alright, just waiting for the link to pop up. This is not. This is admittedly not a very good round of uh, games. So I have a feeling I know which one's going to win it. Waiting on the straw poll. Dan, you demanded for the Switch, so you might <laughs> want to get on it. <laughs> Dan might be dead. Dan Tenmar, please give me the link, because Dan is in, in space right now, apparently. Dan, Dan passed out after the impeachment. Oh, no, there it is. All right, there's Dan. All right, yeah, click on it. Sorry, Tenmar, click on Dan's. And I wonder what's winning this. Let me guess. Oh my god, it's like I'm shocked! <laughs> Bomb Ran X Zero with a 50% lead, Spider Man for PlayStation 1 for 30%. No one else cares about the rest of the, <laughs> the settings. <laughs> At 11%, 6%, and 5%, it makes me a little bit sad because Mobile Light Force slash Gunbird 1 is actually pretty good. Come on, Spider Man. I believe Singularity is actually supposed to be pretty cool too, but I mean, it's, it's a first person shooter, so I don't know how people are going to feel about that. Spider-Man getting a little bit of ground at 33% to Bomberman Act Zero's 44, so really it's dictating who, what do people want? Do they want multiplayer madness, or do they want, uh... The friendly J Neighborhood Spider-Man. I was gonna say J. Jonah Jameson, but yeah, the Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man is <laughs> also a good one. Spider-Man shooting up the 9% difference, but we're going to give it 30 seconds. It's looking like it's going to be Bomberman X Zero unless there's a push right at the end for Spider-Man. As I said earlier, I just played Edge of Time, and that game was a thing. The game was Definitely what? wasn't Spider- It was a thing. It wasn't Spider-Man 1, I can tell you that much. Shattered Dimensions is actually pretty cool. I play Shattered Dimensions. That's the one with the four oh. different Spider-Mans. I did not play that one. That one was kind of neat. I just played one of the... I played two of them recently. Edge of Time and Spider-Man 3 for Xbox 360. Hmm. That one wasn't too bad. 
All right, 30 seconds, I'm pretty sure, have passed, and uh, there hasn't been that much movement, so it looks like when we come back from this break, we're going to be playing some Bomberman X0 multiplayer. So I'll see you guys momentarily. If you have the game and want to play, get it ready. Oh, subscribe. Oh, wait, we got a subscription? Yep. Uh, Elzen? Is that what I saw? Eisen. Eisen. Eisen D Animaniac, thank you for subscribing. Here is your egg. This better be the egg button this time. You will give me an egg. Excellent, it is. And I'm gonna throw in the second clip. I gotta, I gotta start mixing these clips together for eggs at this point. It was in your best interest to assist me. Not bad. <laughs> so I want you to say you're bad. This is not bad. Oh. See, I imagine there being an audio clip of Wesker just saying you're bad. He d there is one where he just screams, "Incompetence surrounds me." <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I just cut to commercial during that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get the Xbox set up, get a new glass of water, and get something in my stomach because I'm starting to feel tired. I have a feeling X Zero might be the last game of the night. We'll see how long it goes. Mm. All right, I'll be right back. Dan just said he's been waiting in Bomberman Act Zero for two hours now. Dan, you might have a couple problems. Yeah. Addiction's a, addiction's a bad thing. You know what would be funny now? It'd be funny if Dan didn't get in the first match. I'd laugh <laughs> so hard. I would laugh so fucking hard. Update on Madden is now 45 to 6. What? <laughs> God. Alright, let me get uh, Bomberman on screen here. And boot him from the room if he joins, John. You know you want to. <laughs> Don't tell him that's what I'm gonna do.
funny thing is, it's forty-five to six. I don't think there's been a single passing touchdown. cold dark basement could this be a dream or is it reality just make the football tiny it's like we know who's winning at this point <laughs> you sure you just don't want the abuse to be that visible <laughs> remember when the Jets made the AFC championship game two years in a row that was a long time ago it feels It was only like three years ago, though. How a team can fall so quickly. Oh, God, I need more energy. More energy! I'm just eating a bunch of almond bars before we start. More energy! It's not incredibly, incredibly hard. Like, that they would be quite crunchy. What? that almond bars sound incredibly crunchy. They are. They very much are. Why are people asking for Dan to be in the call? Jets did something on defense. Holy crap. And anyone asking, it is a ranked game, not a player, because you guys are the only people in the entire world playing Bobberman, so. The odds of getting a random person in a ranked game. What was the last... Uh, Bomberman game. It wasn't X Zero, was it? One sec, sorry. I <laughs> I had to take a small break and eat something. <laughs> no problem. <clears throat> sorry. Uh, the last Bomberman game that came out was Bomberman Battle Fest Live for the Xbox, I believe. Xbox 360. Mm. So there has not been a Bomberman game since, supposedly. If we can't get people, we're gonna get people. And go! Danny Enigma, first person in. <laughs> Duker second, Mystic Shaman third. Hidden Potential fourth. Icy Blaze fifth. Omega Mage 11, sixth. Doger, 7th. Doger, I, Omega Mage might have been in a match before, but I don't believe Doger has been, so we have at least one new player. Alright, everybody, ready up, and let's play. Hmm. Okay. That might be a reason why there's no more Bombermans. I forgot Hudson Soft went out of business. Well, they got they got uh, absorbed into Konami. Mm. And, and then Konami forced them to only work on cell phone games. Dan, for someone who is Thank so you. excited to play Bomberman, why do you never ready up immediately? 
<laughs> Le legitimate question. Legitimate question. <laughs> if you hadn't readied up right away, I would have just booted you. <laughs> it slips his mind. He wants to cherish the moment. <laughs> Alright, we got two Class Ds playing this round. Proton John and the Juker. We've also got Dan the Enigma, Mystic Shaman, Hidden Potential, Icy Blaze, Omega Mage, and Doger. For those of you who are new to Bomberman Act Zero, here's how it works. It is different than the original Bomberman. This mode... We're playing in called FPB, which I believe is supposed to be first-person bomber, but is not first-person at all. Basically gives you a health meter. Uh, and the longer you stay in a flame, the more damage you take. So it's a little bit more strategic than the original Bomberman. It requires a bit more smart playing. And Dan the Enigma, definitely not playing smart, because he's almost dead already. In fact, Danny Nima is the first one to die. For someone who was gung-ho all night for Bomberman, he sure isn't showing it in his playstyle. Oh, that was a bad idea. Meanwhile, everyone else having the time <laughs> of their lives. Tan got diddled. <laughs> Is really diddle the takeaway from tonight? I don't know how to feel about this. Apparently. I'm not gonna lie. That is tonight's legacy. The diddle legacy. It's a shame. Dan's still the only person out so far. Seven players still in it. 45 seconds on the clock. Once the clock reaches one minute left, uh, hurry mode kicks in where blocks start raining from the sky. This is the point where pretty much everyone dies because everyone's health starts draining and the stage gets smaller and smaller until there's no room left to move at all. Omega Mage 11 is the second person knocked out. We've got 16 seconds left before Hurry Mode kicks in. Doger just got trapped. Going to take a lot of damage there. And drop most of his items. Someone is running around with remote bombs. Those are the green bombs you see on the map. They are very dangerous. But not as dangerous as infinite bombs. For anyone wondering, the pink ones go through soft blocks, but after a little while, there's no soft blocks left at all, so they just really become normal bum. Joger knocked out of the match. We're down to five players with hurry mode going on here now. Make that four. We just lost Juker. Hidden Potential's out! Oh, everyone else is gone but Proton John! John takes the first point! With a nice little steal of that remote bomb helping him out tremendously. We need a Madden style commentary for Pomerman. Well, you see here with the bomb and the placement and the power ups. Give me a sec. Once I get my energy back up, I can do this. <laughs> you see, Rudy, with the footballs and the bombs flying around everywhere, you gotta go for Brett Favre. Brett Favre is the bomberman you want on your team. Because he will throw a bomb so far, you'll throw an end goal kick 
with your hands. You see?